and I would like to invite you to my backyard to have a great summer, but you'll have to bring your own lawn chair, your own umbrella, and your own helmet. We have aggressive hawks. July 10th, I was attacked on the back of my head, broke skin, bled. The, the lady did call me back, and what happened? I got referred to the DNR, starting all over again. Oh, and my husband has not a pitchfork, but he has a rake to help protect me. The next day after I was attacked, it came frontal view to my face. It looked like a torpedo with wings. And it's a protected animal, so you can't do anything to solve the problem permanently. Say no more. What happens, the new developments have these small trees, the old neighborhoods have the bigger trees, and now it seems like we're getting more of them because this does not solve the problem for me when someone says they need a place to live too. Here I am today at the local level trying to pull in you to take an active role on managing this aggressive hawk situation and any aggressive animals that we have to live amongst us. That when someone calls that they've been actually attacked or at least swooped upon and they were able to avoid it, I got a backyard pool. It's really hard to swim like this, but you can try. Go ahead. And it's hard to pull weeds and keep your yard up. You can walk your dog, but bring your equipment, all right? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.